This your girl Puff reacts back with another video. Today, I screen recorded my boy Corey Pritchett on live Facebook. He was spitting a lot of game, giving it to us hard. You hear me? Even had a legend come in and give his take on what he know about Corey so far in the short amount of time he's known. And in my opinion, it, it speaks volumes. It spoke so many volumes to know that he could be 23 years old with so much wisdom, so much common sense. Um, as he continuously states, he's been taught how to move and maneuver around certain situations and in certain areas to get to the point where he's at now. And then I think we as a people have to stop hating. See, a lot of niggas, they, they already, my granddad told me when a person gets grows up and they get set in their ways, it's hard to convince a person because they think they know it all. So you can't, sometimes you'll be talking to a brick wall, but see, a child, you can mold a child. That's why more people would, would do for a child than a grown person because once you become grown, you're stuck in your ways. You think you know what you know already. All right, cool, go figure it out on your own. But see, this kid, he ain't going to caution the shit I'm saying to him. He ain't finna question me. He ain't finna tell me you're right or wrong. Because I know for a fact what I'm telling you ain't gonna lead you down the right path in life. So just listen to me. The kids go listen. See, you grown motherfuckers, you teenagers and all that shit. See, y'all wanna laugh, kiki, ha, 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 joking shit with the woo and think shit a game and think you know it all. That's fine with me. I'm not here to talk to you. I know some people that watching me that really listen to me. Long that listen, you see what I'm saying? You hear what I'm saying? Because what, 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 what kills me is when people watch me and the shit that I speak, no matter how you feel, there go the motherfucking man with the motherfucking plan. Hey, listen, man. I'm just man for the man with the plan. <laughs> now, I'm on live right now, right? And I'm on here getting game. You know, I'm, I'm giving you, I'm giving you your flowers while, you know what I'm saying? Why? <laughs> he got flowers in his shirt right now. I ain't gonna show him because he really, man, he really like, he don't mind being on camera, but he really behind the scene now, nigga. But this man here teach me so much shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Hey, real talk. Why well, I'm gonna lie? You want me to show your face? Or you want to just say it? You just said it. <laughs> he said, he said, he said, you can just say it. Since you met me, you met me in October, right? Yeah. How long you know about me? Uh, about a year. So you knew about me about a year. So when you first met me, when you first came here, man, till today, what can you say? Now let these folks know. You got 70 million plus records sold. You got five Grammys. You done seen the rich, you done, you, you, you still there, but you the you the, you the seen the lifestyle that the celebrity like us, see, like, you the, you the made that happen for people. You made motherfucking superstars, so you, of course, had to go through the whole success and all that shit with them, because you was dying them. You seen all that shit already. So, as a, from you to me, what would you tell them about me that would motivate them? That maybe I already said, but they don't believe me, you gotta come with somebody else. It's, 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 it's your, your ability to adapt. It's like, your learning process is so fast. And that's what you have to do to be able to succeed because life, society, social media, everything moves at a, at a whole different pace now. So if you are learning, like slow to learn, then you quick to be left behind. Yeah, you be stuck you, behind. on the other hand, are the exact opposite of that. That's why things are happening so fast. Right. That's why things are happening so not only fast, but organically, like, you actually plant roots on every step that you take it. You're not taking leaps with no substance in between. Right. Like, you're building a structure for you to be able to continue to build off that will never fold. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? But I try to show you. So, you have to have the ability to pivot. You have to have the ability to be able to see things before they happen. You have to have the ability to put yourself in places that only you may see yourself in. Nah, exactly. Exactly right. You know what I'm saying? But like I told him, it's like, I just told him just then. I said, you know, like I told him, I asked you, I like, bro, I don't understand why. I won't say I'm wasting time because I know I'm not, but why I give so much energy and try to spit out motivation and show people the life they can live when a lot of motherfuckers don't want to take it. They, they want a handout. I told him I could just say, fuck it, I'm rich, I'm going to live my life. I mean, that's because you, like, you really truly care about people, you know? And, and you really truly care about changing people's perspective that don't have the same perspective of understanding that they can have whatever it is that they see or that they want. Yeah, I was just showing them that shit. I was just showing them, like, all the posts I post, like, 
five years ago where I was saying I'm gonna do all this. It's like it's, it's like when you and do listen, something you want your people to, you know, what I'm saying to be able to do it too. Exactly, it's, that's all. You can do it, so that's all. Right. Like, if I do it, I, I want y'all know y'all can do it. You don't gotta hate me, but this a nigga just told me just then. Nigga said, so I'm on here getting them. I'm showing them all this, right? Right. So as I'm showing you all these all of a sudden these status of the catfish, that's free game. Right. I'm showing you how the fuck I did what I'm doing. Right. Nigga say. Man, fuck all that. Show up. You want to help or give, give us some bread. So, if, if, <laughs> <laughs> here's the thing about it, right? Let's just say you did give him some bread. I tried to give him $100 a, cash a, and he wouldn't person, take it. A person who don't know really what the value of that $100 is is more dangerous. And that's more of a weapon that can be used against them rather than them being able to understand what that bridge significantly signifies because it's not about the money. It's about the thought It's about process. the knowledge and the thought process. And the, listen, I told him that day, I say, man, listen, I say, the shit that I'm showing you right now can teach you how to make a million, a million, a million, a million. I'm going to give you a hundred dollars, you will go spend that bitch, you will need a hundred dollars again. Exactly. Not only that, now you done created a habit or a need with that hundred dollars. So now, every time you need a hundred dollars, he go come to me every time. Hey, you, you gave me a hundred dollars, can I get a hundred dollars, can I get a hundred dollars, you know what I'm saying? So it's just like, you know, with a person with that type of mentality, just use the example of, you can love your kid to death, and they turn 16, never drove a car before, but just because you can, you can get them a fucking, a Porsche or a Ferrari. But then they go and kill themselves. I just told they you. Didn't have they didn't the have the lessons that it took to understand, to build to, to that. So money, things of, of, of those things are not motivating factors. They can be dangerous in the wrong hands. I just told them that. Yeah. So, you know, I just told them that exact shit. But what bothers me in life is, coming from you, a motherfucker be like, oh, he just said some real shit. But I said the same thing. All because he an older nigga, he real, but I'm a young nigga and you don't want to listen. But what bothers me about that logical thinking is like, but bitch, you see where I'm at. Uh-huh. <laughs> they got to learn how to connect the dots. They're only seeing the pieces, but they're not understanding how they connect. You know what I'm saying? And so a person, not everybody's going to see. I know, and, and, and I understand, and I understand and it. I understand. That's, 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 the, that's the hurtful part. Because it's, it's hurtful to see people not reach their potential. Like, that hurtful you just. Way. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just born and you just, you, just, you just a piece of shit that walking on earth, basically. I hate to say it like that, but it's the truth. Because what did you do to contribute to anything as you was living? You just, like, a lot of people really wake up just to die. Like, think about it. Motherfuckers wake up and do a same. Like, bro, when I was working at that, that Hyundai plant in my grandma, bro, I swear to God, I met people that said, that we've been here for 13 years, we 14 years. And I said to myself, I say, which is normal, but everybody not normal. I'm not normal. I said, so you mean to tell me for 12, 14 years, you get up every motherfucking day at 6 o'clock a.m. and do the same shit every day. You don't go out and experience life. You see the same. It's people in a small town. I, I really think about this shit because I travel a lot now, so I go places, I see shit. So when I go out to these places, these different cities, these different state country, I'm seeing the life that's out here. And I go back to think about my hometown. I got four traffic lights in my hometown. And I think about some people that I know people that don't leave that damn city. That's scary, bro. That's their choice. Exactly. It's not. That's your choice. You can be like when people be like, oh, man, Harvard be successful. I, oh, nobody support me in my city. It ain't shit. When, when, when it take for you to get up and leave your city and go somewhere else where you get support? I say To after you become successful, You're waiting for support. it ain't gonna it never come. come. You got to put the fucking work in and get the support. Don't you feel to realize? Yeah. Support don't. This people be like, oh, nobody support my YouTube channel. Okay, what the fuck is you doing for the support? Oh, right. uh, well, I dropped the video last month. So how the fuck you expect means of people to support what you got going on when you ain't trying to goddamn get the means of people's attention? Right. You see what I'm saying with the work? No, they want to do the least amount to get the most attention. They don't understand this shit right here, man. This shit ain't it's for the average. It's it's work. It's it's, it's twenty five hours a day. 366 days a year because you know what I'm saying at the end of the day it ain't no all time period now we're just trying to do something out of the ordinary look at what he said just then 25 hours in a day no he said 25 hours a day so the normal person's life is 24 hours a day we got a little extra hour we got a little extra hour because that's that extra hard work we put in and we make extra time yeah. see it's on 24 hours a day that ain't that ain't enough for me I need one more hour because I'm gonna put I'm gonna push that extra work in and make sure you know what I'm saying it ain't gonna happen I and it ain't gonna like oh an hour added, but I'd have put in enough work. Well, it take an hour for you to do. 
Mm-hmm. Right, so while you sleeping, yeah. while you sleeping and while you fucking off and you laughing, kiki got high, joking, trolling and shit, wasting all that time, bitch, we working. And sacrifice. And sacrifice. Yeah, Every day. Every fucking day. Take and you watch it. Take and you and take you watch it. Come on, man. Matter of fact, I gotta go pick up these uh clothes that I got from the party. It's just like nice and cool. Yeah, we're gonna go shop when I get home. I gotta go buy some uh designer shit, man. Yeah, this thing. <laughs> that thing ain't rich for no reason, boy. But, man, I hope somebody screen recorded that, man. You know what I'm saying? Take that live and run with it. Yeah, I thought that live was really dope. If you caught that live, kudos to you because he dropped a lot of game. If you didn't, because I saw a lot of people cutting out around this part. If you didn't, that sucks for you because you missed a lot of essential key information and progression that he showed us. You know, just going back, showing us how he manifested the life that he's living. We need to start listening and start manifesting the life we want to live too. Or unless we want to just die broke or die poor in the mindset and in the heart and in money. And on that note, that's the video with your girl, Puff Reacts. Peace.